this is the first that you're seeing of me this week. Uh, yesterday was ended up being basically a write-off. I didn't really eat anything all day, but I just spent the day moping and sleeping. Um, but anyways, I'm over it. So it's Tuesday morning. It is actually 10 o'clock right on the dot. And I'm having breakfast, so I wanted to show you my breakfast. This will be my breakfast every day this week. So um, it's just an omelet made with two eggs. And inside there is um, some spinach and kale that I sauteed up with mushrooms and garlic and turkey bacon and I mixed it, put it in there, and then I put a little bit of feta cheese in there. And then on top is just a little bit of shredded um, nacho cheese and so like it's like, a, I don't know, a mix of cheese and um, some hot sauce. So there's my breakfast. Alright guys, it's workout time. This is on the schedule today. Tabata Strength. There's week four, day two. Tabata Strength. finish my workout well uh, 26 minutes of it um, basically the the DVD player started like freezing and skipping and whatever at 26 minutes and then it was like whatever so I was like I'm basically done so um, I just stopped because it's you know my workouts are only 30 minutes long so 26 minutes it was like I was pretty much done and then it's like I was gonna like take the DVD out put it back in and then restart it, but then it was like, I'm already like done. You know what I mean? Like then I cooled down, so then I was like, whatever, it's not worth starting up again. Um, so anyway, so it was basically a 26 minute workout. I burned 254 calories, and it was really good up until that point. And then I didn't vlog, and it all worked out, I guess, because then my parents showed up like as soon as that happened as well, so I couldn't really continue anyways. Um, so anyway, so that's also why I didn't sit here and tell you about my workout right after my workout. So anyways, yes, but I did get it done. Um, I just had a cup of coffee with my parents. Um, they've left now, so I'm going to make myself my shake really quick. And then I have a um, Zoom call. And yeah. Alright, here's dinner tonight. Just two tacos. Um, there is some... Uh, baby spinach and kale in the bottom and then some ground turkey made with taco seasoning and then a little bit of shredded cheese and then some sour cream and tomatoes on top. Alright guys, so it is uh, 7.30 and I felt kind of like I was missing something in my life, not snacking. I felt like I should be snacking or or whatever and then I remembered I got my tea. So, uh, so just in case you didn't see my last video, I'll show you guys this tea that I got. It's basically green tea with mango. It like smells really, really good. So I got it steeping because it's loose leaf tea. So I got it steeping there. Um, so I'm going to drink that and i am got a long night ahead of me. So it's fine. It's green tea so it's caffeinated, but that's okay because I got a lot of work to do tonight. So, um, so yeah, that's my day. I successfully did my intermittent fasting. I only ate within an eight hour window. The only thing is I did have lots of coffee, but it's National Coffee Day, so that's okay. And uh, yeah, so otherwise I'm pretty happy with how today went. Good morning. It's Wednesday morning. It is 9.52 a.m. And I want to show you what an uh, omelet that is a hot mess looks like. There's my poor omelet this morning. It doesn't look as beautiful as usual, but it'll taste the same. Exact same thing as I had yesterday. This is about to go down workout time and it's 20 after 11 so I'm like 10 minutes early today
All right, guys, workout's done. Um, I maxed out at 6.33, which is about where my max out time was last week, too. But last week was really two weeks ago, so anyways. Um, I burned 349 calories in 32 minutes. And when I just stopped my watch, my heart rate was still pretty high. So it was a really good workout. I pushed really, really hard. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna make a shake now. Maybe have a shower. Here's supper tonight. It's like a Greek salad with quinoa um, and some feta cheese on top. So it's just like cucumbers and tomatoes and Greek salad dressing and olives and feta cheese and quinoa. And a little thought it is early Thursday morning um, and it is October 1st so first day of the month some new month um September was personally a very difficult month for me all all around so I'm glad that it's a new month um, but last night I spent a lot of time stressing and really pushing to try and um, hit a goal I had set for myself for the month of September in my business I didn't end up hitting that goal after trying so hard last night um, and I got really down about it last night a bit and I did stress eat like eight squares of 70% dark chocolate so that wasn't good uh, so yeah so I woke up this morning feeling kind of bloated and whatever but I am choosing positivity and so I wanted to share with you guys kind of how I'm moving on from this um, basically I am just, I, I found three things from the month of September that I was really proud of myself for, even though I didn't hit my, you know, main goal for the month or whatever. Um, and I'm just focusing on the new month, setting my 10 new goals for this month. One of which is to vlog every week and to stick to my workout program, of course, um, complete max 30. So, so yeah, and I'm also really excited because there's this brand new program, um, that's not released yet called the uh, Master's Hammer and Chisel. And it's basically uh, Sagi Kalev, the body beast guy, and uh, um, Autumn Calabrese, the 21 day fix girl, and they made this program together. And there's a sample of the workouts um, on Beach Boy On Demand, so I'm really excited to give that a try. So um, I haven't decided if I'm gonna try it today or maybe I might do it like on Saturday because I don't have a scheduled workout on Saturday, but we'll see, I'll see how I'm feeling. Um, so yeah, my throat really hurts. I feel like I'm like getting a new cold all over again. So I don't even know. But anyways, positivity, positive thoughts all the way. Um, I've had, I woke up, I think I like half of this and I drank it all. It's 24 ounces. So I'm going to finish this one really quick right now. And then it's going to be time to, I'm going to, now I'm going to check in with my um, challengers, my challenge group, and it's going to be time to get my daughter up. Um, so I will see you guys later. Pull it, act like my hands are right away. All right, Tabata Strength is done. That is week four, day four in the book. Ooh, I forgot to stop my watch. I just finished though. My heart rate still is like 146, so it's still pretty high. But anyways, let me see. Uh, 32 minutes and 319 calories burnt. I'm soaked. Um, I'm feeling really crappy this morning. Um, I don't know, like I had a cold a couple weeks ago and then I felt like it was kind of getting better. And then last night, actually, I was getting a sore throat again. And um, this morning, I was like, have a sore throat again. And I'm feeling really run down. So I was like telling myself, oh, I'm going to just have to do what I can do. But I don't think I'll be able to really push it this workout. Um, and then partway into the workout, like a few minutes in, I was like, screw that, man. Like, I am going to push it. And I did push it. And it was really hard. But if you look. My max out time was 11.07. Here was my last max out time for Tabata Strength, 7.16. Last week's max out time, 6.40 and 7.08. So I did really good. So I'm very proud of myself and that's the last time that I do Tabata Strength. So yeah, that's that. All right guys, so I just realized I haven't actually been showing you my lunch every day. Um, it's always been this. Today I have a wine glass. This wine glass is the best. It's like, it looks like a crystal wine glass. It looks like it's glass, but it's actually plastic. So it's flare proof. So yeah, so basically my lunch every day is one cup of unsweetened almond milk, uh, one cup of water, some ice, um, chocolate, vegan chocolate chocolate, 
and a teaspoon of peanut butter. It is delicious. It will make me feel better. All right, guys, so tonight is uh, skating night. My daughter has skating lessons on Thursday from 4.30 to 5. So basically, we're going to just be doing crock pot meals on Thursdays. Tonight, I made one of my favorites, which is um, taco chicken chili. And I'm going to show you it now because then my parents are coming over for dinner tonight, so I probably won't show before I eat. But there it is. Yum, yum, yum. And really, all it is is it's just a can of... It's very budget-friendly, too. It's just a can of... Um, of beans I just get like the six bean mix or whatever um, and then a can of diced tomatoes and then a can of tomato sauce um, some frozen corn and I just do like three big chicken breasts and then I just season it with taco seasoning and chili powder and a bit of garlic powder um, and a bit of extra cumin as well so it's really really good so I'll have that I'll have a little bit of cheese on it a little bit of sour cream on it and I'll probably have um, like a small dinner roll bun with it as well as I think we're doing salad with it as well so that'll be my dinner tonight alright guys so it is Saturday morning and I'm doing Friday fight round one. It was supposed to be Friday's workout, um, but Fridays are kind of tricky for getting my workouts in. So this is basically like my plan going forward is that I'm gonna work out first thing in the morning on Fridays. Um, but yesterday <clears throat> I woke up like my throat was so sore and I felt like crap. So I stayed in bed instead of getting up and working out. Um, and it did me well. I feel a bit better. So anyways, I'm getting Friday fight done now on Saturday um, And it snowed here last night a little bit. So I'm very cold and I'm ready to be warm now guys Friday fights done um, I added about 10 seconds to my max out time on that one and I burned 353 calories in 32 minutes